In the spring of 2017, Boogie Brew and our live work community of Centerville in Northern California was assaulted with a nasty chemical application to our trees, a pesticide called, coincidentally enough, a sale. And it's manufactured by Bayer, who now own Monsanto, no less. This toxic compound is called a neonicotinoid, also known as acetaminoprid or APE. In addition to causing reduced fertility rates and altered reproduction in humans, acetaminoprid and the entire class of neonicotinoid chemicals, which APE is derived from, has actually been linked to the widespread disappearance of honeybees, which is contributing to the terrifying spread of something known as CCD, or Colony Collapse Disorder. APE and myriads of other chemical insecticides are often referred to as systemics. Systemic products, meaning that they will travel up a plant's tissue structure and subsequently cause neurotoxicity to the bugs who are consuming the leaf surfaces of the plant. Now, what the chemical manufacturers neglect to tell you is that these systemics are also bioaccumulators, meaning that they will travel up the entire food chain. It's a farcical and dangerous game of cat and mouse, and it ends up doing nothing to actually improve insect control. And it renders our planet and all mammalian, aquatic, and invertebrate species more susceptible to cancer, immune disorders, allergies, and multiple other health risks. The question is why? Why are communities sprayed with these kinds of compounds to begin with? What precipitates their heinously toxic application? Well, in Boogie Brew's particular case, it was apparently because our neighborhood's walnut trees were naturally defending themselves from aphids. And they were doing this by secreting a protective sap, which was dripping onto our sidewalks and even cars parked underneath them. God forbid, should people's automobiles be dirtied by nature's trees. No, let's poison ourselves instead. Now the real question is, what are we gonna do about this insanity? The answer is to simply stop the application of all dangerous chemicals to begin with. In Boogie's situation, we went door to door, simply asking our neighbors to sign a simple petition that demands an end to all chemical sprays and only allow for organic and natural alternatives when strictly necessary. All you need to do is say no to all synthetic spraying and say yes to healthier alternatives like neem oil and soap. Organic horticultural oils are harmless to our environment and best of all, they're highly effective. Simply put, these compounds were never safe to begin with and their existence should be banished from our precious planet altogether. Share this same petition in its digital form with everyone you know. Utilize the unstoppable momentum powered by the strength in numbers of change.org to empower your community in defending itself from the senseless application of dangerous chemicals. Sign the petition to banish the use of synthetic sprays in America's neighborhoods today.